Hello and welcome to Lord Alexander's Mansion, a uh, Thief 2 fan mission by Bulgarian Taffa. This one does have a full briefing video, so let's watch it. Rumors say that Lord Alexander owns a prize scepter passed down through generations. I have my experience with stealing scepters, and this one is guaranteed to be more valuable than the one I got from Lord Bafford. It's a good enough reason to pay a visit to Lord Alexander's mansion, and trusted sources told me that his lordship is on holiday out of the city with his wife. Still, I don't expect to be a welcome guest on his property. There is no doubt that the scepter is well protected, and I have yet to decide which strategy is best for this job. I am not a fan of front doors, as they are always well guarded. However, this time it may be worth the risk. If I am able to sneak past the guards, I will get close to Alexander's bedroom, which is the perfect place to look for the scepter's whereabouts. The mansion also has a side gate, which is usually protected by a single swordsman. If I decide to go that way, I'll have to find my way by the guards on the inside. And of course, there is a third option. A careless servant could have left an open window, and I won't forget to bring some rope arrows, just in case. Patience is not a virtue I have, so there is no point in waiting. I just have to go and improvise. It's time to reinforce my reputation as a stealer of royal symbols. Who knows? I may be reborn as a noble, in my next life. No patience and improvising, it sounds exactly like my uh, style of play. So, uh, well. Hmm. Most of it's tougher and rookie only different loot. Uh, Lord Alexander isn't the poorest fellow in this town, and I need money to pay my rent. I need to obtain at least 700 loot. And I'm here to steal a prize scepter of Lord Alexander, this is my primary goal. I've got to expert, or master as you're calling it. Um, not only do I need to pay my rent, but with the recent appointments of Sheriff Truett, daily life has become more difficult than ever. I need to obtain at least 900 to have my base needs covered. And avoid unnecessary bloodshed. Well, I will avoid unnecessary bloodshed anyway, but I'm not going to leave it up to a script that uh, controls objectives to decide what bloodshed is necessary and what is unnecessary. So I'll stick with the hard, which they're calling rookie here. And I'll see how see how that works out. Alright, now the reason I'm playing this uh, mission right now is because it was just released two days ago. Uh, at the moment that I'm recording this, it was released on the 7th of August this year. And so that makes it the newest fan mission that's been released. And I'm going to follow it up after this one with playing the very earliest fan mission. Uh, but we'll come back to that when I finish here. Let's see. Look at the guards. Lots of guards by the front gate. 
do I have a map? I don't have a map of this place at all. That's that's fine. It's just uh... oh, you you should have gone back the other way. Hmm. Very small circle of. Because I've been here only a few months. Oh, this one. Can I get around that side of the house? Get away with Looks like maybe I can. Maybe. Well, almost walked into somebody's face there. Lucky for me, his face is pretty blind. Oh, he's getting away. The other guy's not up here yet. Alright. It's actually very, very bright. I'm just going to go adjust the uh, gamma down. Although well, it doesn't be taking effect. Nah, it's not really... It's not having any effect at all. Oh well. I could rope up into the balcony there. I didn't even check what equipment I've got. Sword, obviously. Five broadheads, three water arrows, two moss. Two ropes, one noisemaker. Got my trusty lockpicks, and nothing else. Don't even have a compass. Now that's that's harsh, but uh, it's not a very large mansion, so hopefully I won't need to know which way is the north to avoid getting lost. Mm, can I get around the back of the mansion? I don't know. Well, this is the side door, which hadn't been my hadn't been my plan to come in this way. I was hoping to look for a window or something. It doesn't look to me from here like I can get around the back. It's just darkness like. Hard to judge. Everything feels really bright to me. But isn't in terms of my invisibility. A little bit of patience is good. No, I can't go around the back. I'll wait till he comes back up and turns around again. I'll, I'll do what I can to sneak without them ever seeing me. I'll uh, see how that goes. I wouldn't expect uh, a great deal, given I have no idea what the layout of this mansion is like and my aforementioned lack of patience. Yeah, very odd noise. Wonder what it could be. Sounds nothing like somebody picking a lock. Alright, we've got a nice dark room here. Oh, there's a guard coming and going. Doesn't actually come down here, does he? No, he's walking noisily above my head. Well, that's an interesting uh, pair of doors. Right off we've got horrible, horrible, horrible marble claws. I've got two moss arrows. Yeah. I think trying to get upstairs first is probably going to do me a little bit better than uh, sticking down here. All, all very stony. Ooh, he's got a key. I'll take that. Don't worry, nobody's tapping around down here. Must be one of them grubbers again. Yeah, it's just the grubbers. Hey! <gasps> ow, 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 that didn't work. You're in for it now! Oh, yeah. Well, he... He uh, hit me and then ran away. Uh... That's all right, let's create her. I was going to say, let's put a stick of rope to get, create an uh, exit, but let's climb this ladder. To be safe from the guards up here, I do see a spider in the distance, but that's alright, I can deal with that. Let's read what this papyrus says, while he searches fruitlessly for me down there. What kind of a mansion is this? When I accepted this job as a guard, I thought I'd be guarding a huge building like the manor of Sheriff Truitt. Instead, I find myself in a place barely bigger than a house. There's no place for all of us to sleep, 
And while some of my colleagues are able to return home and get some rest after their shift, I live on the other side of the city. That's why I'm stuck here, trying to sleep in this awful corner. I can hear the rats squeaking in the attic. Ah, I hate rats. I'm so scared of them. Anyway, when the master returns home, I'll ask him to move me somewhere else. If he refuses, I'm leaving. You, you tell him. I'll find you. At least you got some excitement tonight. We have... Gloria Doll. Well, there's a spider there. Test my sneaking skills on a spider. Ah. It's dead. Not merely knocked out, but uh Yeah, yeah, quiet, you noisy noisy rat. Is there any actually anything up here? Well, I think I heard the guard down below walking through the door again, which probably means he's given up a search. So killing time here. Oh, there's these nice beams. Oh. There's a ten digit control panel for something. No idea what. Alright, it looks important, but I guess I'll find out what it's for later. Let me just try something here. Nope, no response. Anything on these rafters? Apparently, there is no loot up here. Alright, that's fine. What's the best way? Quietest way down? Mm. Another rope, I guess. Nah. Not enormously quiet, but hopefully quiet enough. Well, the guards are going back to their patrol there. Well, he doesn't actually seem to come up here, as far as I can see. <coughs> Except when searching for uh, tappers on the loose. He does come straight back from there right away, which is quite inconvenient. I heard that you. Oh, bollocks! I'll turn you up soon enough. Ah, more marble. You know, I should really just knock this fellow out. I've, I've alerted him twice now, and he's just making life difficult for me. Flash bombs. So I guess if he sees me again, I'm, I'm gonna run up the ladder again. Oh, he's giving up. I wonder, can I get an air mid air knockout on him? Nope. He's going to get more guards. Hey, over here! Help! All right, all right, all right. <clears throat> Whatever. You guys can all sleep up here for all I care. It's not very dark. Let's let's move you out of the way. Well, our friend who ran away after hitting me before has run away again. So I guess he's the he's the courageous guard here. Why's everybody yelling around down there? God, he's brought the whole... He's brought everybody. There's someone in the building. Look at them all. Oh, it's a party. Wow. He literally brought everybody. Uh, 
Show me. You've met with the wrong man, thief. Yeah, this is getting well for me, isn't it? Very well. I don't have any healing, so uh, I'm going to take whatever punishment they. Deal. Feet. I can't. I think they're above me, but I can't really tell. Yeah, I'm not doing this uh, as stealthily as I predicted, am I? Come on over here. Come in range. Oh, I think he's going back outside. Just wait till I find you. too much use of the fact that uh, in in pitch darkness you can actually blackjack them from behind but uh, uh, even when they're even when they're alert and searching god what is going on what's all this noise I hear oh well, there's my moss arrow conveniently put for me to escape through there while I'm all searching upstairs which I completely failed at doing Very, very noisy in here. And uh, we get flung back by physics. She's. Can't tell if they're coming in this room or not. Like, let's try the other door. It looks darker in this corner. Which is. Hopefully, shut out some of the uh, extraneous sounds now. Is there anyone left to patrol into this room or not? Or should I just make a run for it? I just make a run for it, of course. Who's over there? Quit tapping with me, guy. Hey, hold it right there. Hold it right where? I don't know what you're talking about. Good thing you guys don't know how to get to the attic. Be sorry or later. With my secret escape Wait, plan. Some tappers in here. Right, so he's going to alert everybody again. This is brilliant. Right, I think I'm hearing noise from down here as well as up there. So I'm going to close these doors. So that we don't get all the sound reverberating from the stairwell. And let's hope that other guy's gonna stay away. Oh, it's locked. Do I have the key? What's that key I got? Oh, it's a stairway. Nice fancy bookshelf. Ah, the drunken guard. All right, well, we'll leave him. Oh, he's down below me. Oh, one goes in, one comes out. And then they both go out again. Is there anything of value down here? Not obviously. Oh, there's a chest under the stairs, alright. Let's go to that quietly. Yay! Money. <laughs> we 
is it the same key? Where is it? There it is. It is indeed. Yeah, where's this guy going? I don't care. He's going with me. And he's also gonna go to sleep in the attic. Yeah, I'm gonna make noise. You can sleep in the steps. Marble floors everywhere. Tapest delight. Alright, let's steal silver flute. Well, there's not many guards left, and I can always run back up to the attic again. I wonder what this has to say. Oh, it's just music. Okay. No! Stop! Well, at the risk of making tons of noise, I'm going to run up here and uh, play the organ. I can't play the organ. All right, at least. What do we have here? Look, I know. Uh, I don't know quite how they didn't see me there. Ah, oh, they did see me. Uh, well, I see a book there I should read. Oh, yeah. No, he's not coming in here? That's my problem, is I can't really go over to the desk. It's a bit too bright. Why don't you come over here, huh? Or go back outside. That suits me, too. You give up your search, it's fine. Alright, what does this have to say? Oh, I'm so excited. My loving husband is taking me on a trip out of town. I haven't felt happier since the moment he proposed to me. Ah, that was the best day in my life. A rainy day in mid-April as we walked on the soft grass in Oldale Park. When he showed me the diamond ring, he dropped to his knees and asked me to marry him. But I digress. These memories are precious to me, but I'm certain the best times are yet to come. Did she leave her diamond ring here? She did indeed. Well, that was a mistake. Best memories of, of having to recover your own diamond ring at great expense from local pawn shop. Oh. We are back here again. Which means that's the stairway. This is the... That's the upper balcony. Right. Uh, then where is Lord... Alexander's bedroom with which hopefully had information on where to find this terrible uh, I say terrible I mean valuable scepter all right one more mass arrow is it dark in this corner it looks dark let's just use it here so I can scout see what's going on. We've got fishes swimming in the fountain. It's nice. Let's keep our escape route open. Oh, it's down. That's up. Hmm. Looks like a secret door of some kind. Nothing uh, valuable in the bathroom. It doesn't appear. Yeah. Hmm. No switches hiding around here, are there? If that's not a secret door, I'll eat my blackjack. So where do they go? They go out that door, and then they come out, and then they come back out, and then through the one directly ahead. And he turns right. 
does look to me like they're following the same path. And then they're not in that room very long before they come back out again. I'm headed through there with a they spend a little more time in that room, so when they both go into that room on the left is my chance to strike. So that looks like a chapel sort of place through there. Let's try and avoid treading noisily on this floor. Who's there? Oh, this is the bloody staircase again. I'm going around in circles. Hmm. Can't put the light out. Can't really get closer than this and still be in darkness. So now I've got to wait for them to go again. Do you hear me? I wonder if there's a better way down. I wonder, you know? No, 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 alright. Can we get out here? Maybe. Oh yeah, there's a wooden, wooden beam above me. I can stick a rope in there. Should be able to get down here. Without Mr. Oh gosh, sir. Mr. Imbibed or rather a bit too much bothering me. Yeah, I can just leave him to his business. Alright, what I'm thinking is oh, I can slip around the other side. Oh, he's coming back. I maybe actually do better by getting in the front door. I don't know. Still no need to wake up all the guards, right? Oh, one of the ones from the front uh, balcony here has disappeared. And this one from the side, I guess they were some of the ones that came to chase me. Quit tapping with me, guys. Come up now, whoever you are. Fight me, you coward. Well, that woke him up. Thanks to awkwardly trying to climb and making way too much noise. I'm closing in, Tapper. Not quite sure how I could reach the uh, lock well enough to use a key like that, but uh, he can. Mm -hmm. Alternatively, I'll try and get back over there. Probably make too much noise again. Is anybody actually coming down here or are they coming up there? I can't tell. <coughs> Who's that? Please don't play games. Well, I mean, playing games is a oh, lot of, it's the whole business here. Uh -huh. Hello? Anyone there? That's close. I just threw a plate across the room. Somehow I didn't spook at hearing that. What's that in front of you there, sir? Pack of cards, I think. Probably nothing important. Ah, oh, wooden floor. Look at it, it's gorgeous and quiet and... Well, there's a guard here. And he's not asleep. And there's other two that come in through here. So I should see where they come. Uh, or deal with them if they come too close to me. Which they both want to do. Alright, I'll just deal with them both. Nothing making noise now. Imagining things now. Why don't you? Hmm. Yeah. 
What do you go over there? Strange noises. Yeah. What do you go over there? You've made a big mistake, Tapper. Not as big as the one you're about to make. Come to Papa now. You're about to be found sleeping on duty. It's <sighs> a very big mistake. All right. That sounds like it was wood. How odd. All right. So this is Lord Alexander's bedroom. Is that a wooden roof? It looks wooden. Yeah. Just let's do a quick rope. Just to see if he's hidden anything on top of his bed here. Doesn't appear to be. And uh, what do we got here? Money. Very important. Diary. 1708. I've always felt privileged to be one of the few nobles in the city who has a personal chapel. Even though I'm not as firm a believer as my grandmother was, I'll always remember her teachings about how the great master builder saved the humans from the chaos of the trickster and gave them tools to fight the forces of nature and to construct homes to live in. 2008. Even though the Hammerites don't hold the nobles in high esteem, they know that a good relationship with us is important. It was we who convinced the City Watch to give the Hammerites the privilege of imprisoning the most dangerous criminals. It's not a bad compromise. On the one hand, the Hammer way of rendering justice is quite effective, and on the other, they don't mind helping us with certain affairs. Or at least it was so until recently. 2509. I'd never had a problem with employing a priest to give sermons in my own chapel. Yet things have changed. It's become harder and harder to find a priest who will oblige. I've even begun to suspect that the priests are disappearing. The ones I get in touch with are ill-tempered and are quick to refuse my proposals. 309. Rumours say that the Hammerite Order is in trouble. A trusted member of the Bumbleson family has told me that a large group of them have separated and formed their own order under Karras, a former Hammerite priest. So they haven't really disappeared. He said that the members of the new order call themselves the Mechanists and are quite skillful in constructing new machines. Doesn't sound too bad, but I wonder what will happen to our traditions. And a note in the waste bin 0509. Hey, these Mechanist guys aren't as bad as I thought. I'm leaving town for a while, and I can't just leave my scepter unprotected. It's the most important relic in my mansion. I can't let the guards be the only ones responsible for its safety. While I was wondering what to do, my bubbles and friend told me about the new security devices the mechs have developed. I was impressed. It looks like the Bumblesons have well-established ties with the mechanists. So my friend helped me to obtain a coded security device which I installed in the attic and connected to my secret room where I'm keeping the scepter. I'm sure nobody will be able to guess my four-digit secret code as it's related to a very personal event in my life. Well, I wonder what that personal event would be. Perhaps the day that uh, you got engaged. The bathroom. Just the stairs up, right? Okay, well, let's go back to. I dealt with all the guards up here, right? What yeah. the hell? Yeah, well, not the ones outside. Dang it! All right, come on over here. He's going in there. Uh, right. The best day of my life, a rainy day in mid-April. So something, something, 04, 1404, 1504. I can try some, uh, some combinations for sure. Although, wait. Is this uh, American date format or European? Well, let's assume it'll make some kind of confirmation noise when I get the right digit and, uh, combination. So. Nope. That should do it. Nope. Oh, let's try it again. 1504, apparently. 
I'm not sure, quite sure how Garrett knows that's the right combination, but uh, apparently he's just very skilled with uh, that kind of prediction. him there. Did I go into the chapel? I didn't. Let's check out the chapel before. I do see the secret doors open, so uh, I am sure the chapter I need is there, but first, what is a chapel if not a repository of boring texts and gold loot? Let's read the boring text first. Hammerite Compendium of Precepts, Regimens and Rules of Conduct, Volume 53. To use thy chisel is to blunt its edge against the stone. To not use thy chisel is to waste its edge. So, you must use the chisel of Saint Schrodinger. Or rather, you must both use it and not use it. Alright, I think that's everything from the chapel. Wow, this guy deserves to have all his loot taken. He's so dearly in love with his marble claws. Secret room with the valuable scepter. Nice red ruby on it. Objective complete. We have stolen the prize scepter, but we do not have the 700 loot we need. How much do I have? 675. I'm missing a mere 25 somewhere, I think. <laughs> I see some coins in the fountain. I wonder if those are spicy fish. You never know. There we are, exactly 700. All right, well, uh, mission complete. Well, if we'd been playing down our expert, I uh, would need to collect, I think it was 900. So I'm definitely missing some loot somewhere. I don't know where. That was 29 minutes, eight seconds, and I missed 325 loot. Now, unfortunately, the uh, scepter room wasn't marked as a secret. If there were any other hidden secrets, they were also not marked. Well, there we are. That was uh, Lord Alexander's Mansion. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you here for the next mission.